So by default, the ARP Odyssey uh, is a duophonic synth. That is, oscillator 1 is low note priority and oscillator 2 is high note priority. So when you play two notes, you get... So if you play one note, of course you get both uh, both oscillators playing the same note. So I really wish that there was a way to make this thing monophonic. Like I use this thing on all my gigs to play mostly bass lines uh, because I play in a trio where I play left hand bass. So normally I'm just playing left hand bass lines using one oscillator. because I don't like to have clams when I'm on the gig, which can happen if you have two oscillators going. I'm not that sloppy, but still, it's nice to have a nice clean sound, and having this thing operate in monophonic mode would certainly be a nice thing. Okay, also, when I'm playing a lot of sounds, uh, I wish I could play nice legato lines but the ARP Odyssey always triggers on every note. So it would be really nice to have smooth, connected legato lines. Well, if you look at the back panel of the ARP Odyssey, you will see that uh, the later models, including the Korg one, have all the full complement of CV in and out, gate in and out, and trigger in and out. There is a trick you can do, and it's actually in the manual, where you insert a patch cable, which they so nicely provide, from the gate out into the trigger input. And now, you have legato response. Excellent. So the one I didn't know is that if you patch the CV in into the CV out, now you have a monophonic instrument. Because what happens is by default, the uh, control voltage output is only low note priority. It is a, it's strictly a monophonic uh, CV out. So what you're doing is you're fooling this thing into thinking that it's getting a low note priority signal from some other synth, but it's actually from itself, so... Nice! Okay, so that's great. So I started using that a lot on gigs. And I thought, man, it sure would be nice because sometimes I, I need the duophonic uh, capability when I'm playing certain lead things and uh, even some double stop bass things. Like when we do uh, certain Steely Dan songs, there's some double stops on the bass that are really nice to have two notes. So rather than reaching back here and pulling this uh, patch cable in and out, and sometimes I like to have the legato response, a la Mini Moog, but sometimes I like the, the, the re-trigger thing on every note because it makes a nice, fat, clean bass sound. But again, it's nice to not always have to reach back here and pull a patch cable. So what's a guy to do? I didn't want to modify the synth, like with internal switches or something, uh, to defeat that functionality internally or something, because this, this is a Rev 1 sort of limited edition looking one, and uh, I certainly didn't want to modify it. So I did the next best thing, which is to moodify it. <laughs> this is a little box I built, which I call the ARP Moodifier. It's not the prettiest thing, but it adds a whole lot of functionality to the synth. As you can see, these are inputs which come from those four outputs that we need on the synth. And these are DPDT switches which either connect the connection or defeat the connection. Simple. 
I also went ahead and took the extra step of uh, adding nice quarter inch CV and gate in and out uh, so that I can control other uh, analog synths with the ARP while still having my nice monophonic and uh, legato functionality. So let me demonstrate how it works. So I just have patch cables running from the four outputs on the back of the ARP and now I just plug the uh, the CV in, CV out, the gate out, and the trigger in. So let's test it out. First I'm going to have this in uh, multi-trigger mode. So if I put it in single trigger mode, and it also uh, works with Portamento. Okay, that's great, and you'll notice I've got this in monophonic mode right now too, so that means I can play nice. So it's a monophonic synth. It sounds a lot like a Moog right now, especially because right now I'm using the uh, Moog uh, filter, Moog type filter. There was one slight oversight with this. When I put this thing into duophonic mode, which is the default mode. What's going on here? If you'll notice, I'm playing different notes. But I'm getting no change in pitch. Um, <laughs> whoops. That is because... So inherent in the design of the Odyssey, there is uh, <laughs> an issue where anytime something is plugged into the CV input, this thing is expecting a voltage so it it pretty much disables the keyboard you'll notice as soon as i unplug this i get my i get my pitch back but when i plug it in and i switch this thing into duo no matter what note i hit i get nothing so it's way out of tune right now um so yeah, because what's happening is that double pole, double throw switch is uh, defeating this connection, making this thing pretty much plugged into nothing when I switch it back into duo mode. So if anybody knows a solution for this, uh, I'm all ears. I would certainly like to be able to do this because that function is practically useless right now if it wasn't for the fact that I also included these nice CV and gate outs. It just so happens that I have another analog synth right here. And I've got some control voltage uh, input so for this output and gate. So now, check it out. So I'm going to turn off the sound from the Odyssey for a second so you can just hear the synthesizers.com modular being played from the Odyssey keyboard. So as you can hear, it is monophonic and single trigger, and so is the Odyssey. That's the two playing in tandem. So here's the thing is that the uh, proportional pitch control is part of the pitch CV, so it does work. But the vibrato does not work because that is the function of the internal LFO. Also, Portamino works. Um, so yeah, there it is. 
in all of its partly non-functional uh, glory. <laughs> Oh yeah, so there's like my Lyle Mays type of sound. And there's my Donald Bird sound. Thank you for watching, everybody. This is Moot Booksley. Until next time, be sure to subscribe, leave me some comments, tell me what you think. I love to hear from you.